polyendocrinopathy syndrome, autoimmune, a genetic autoimmune disease with an extraordinary array of clinical features but characterized most often by at least two of the following three findings, hypoparathyroidism, underfunction of the parathyroid glands which control calcium, candidiasis, yeast infection, and adrenal insufficiency, underfunction of the adrenal gland. The autoimmune polyendocrinopathy syndrome was the first systemic, body-wide, autoimmune disease found due to a defect in a single gene. By autoimmune is meant that the immune system, which normally wards off foreign invaders of the body, turns and attacks tissues such as skin, joints, liver, lungs, etc., of the body. Examples of common systemic autoimmune diseases include rheumatoid arthritis, systemic lupus erythematosus, diabetes mellitus, Chagrin syndrome, scleroderma, good pasture syndrome, vitiligo, Addison disease, thyroiditis, and many others. In 1997 a novel gene was identified that mapped to chromosome region 21Q22.3. The gene was named AIR for autoimmune regulator. Changes in the AIR gene are responsible for the autoimmune polyendocrinopathy syndrome. The syndrome is inherited as a recessive trait such that a child with the disease has received two changed, mutant, AIR genes, one from each parent. Although the syndrome is generally rare, it is more frequent in three genetically isolated populations, the Finnish, Iranian Jews, and Sardinians. The child with autoimmune polyendocrinopathy syndrome develops problems in numerous glands, polyendocrine, including hypoparathyroidism, hypogonadism, with sex gland failure, adrenal insufficiency, type 1, insulin dependent, diabetes with insufficient insulin production by the pancreas gland, and latent hypothyroidism, under function of the thyroid gland. Other features of the autoimmune polyendocrinopathy syndrome are total baldness, alopecia totalis, inflammation of the cornea and whites of the eye, keratoconjunctivitis, underdevelopment, hypoplasia, of the enamel of the teeth, childhood onset meniliasis, yeast infection, juvenile onset pernicious anemia, gastrointestinal problems, malabsorption, diarrhea, and chronic active hepatitis. The laboratory studies attest to an immune disease with an abnormally low level of gamma globulin antibodies in blood, hypogammaglobulemia, and an abnormally low T4 T8 white blood cell ratio, as in AIDS. There is specific evidence for autoimmunity with antibodies directed against the adrenal and thyroid glands and against cell nuclei, antiadrenal, antithyroid, and antinuclear antibodies. The treatment of the autoimmune polyendocrinopathy syndrome is directed at treating the specific problems, replacing the various hormones that are in short supply, giving insulin for the diabetes, treating the yeast infections, etc. However, there is no known cure for the autoimmune polyendocrinopathy syndrome. The prognosis, outlook, depends on whether the critical hormone deficiencies are remedied and especially whether the infections can be successfully controlled. The autoimmune polyendocrinopathy syndrome goes by a confusing array of other names including autoimmune polyglandular syndrome, APS, polyglandular autoimmune syndrome, PGA, autoimmune polyendocrinopathy candidiasis ectodermal dystrophy, APECED, hypoadrenocorticism with hypoparathyroidism and supra.